Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the Channel 40 brand new video. As you can see, I'm in the car, currently sweating. It is so, so hot here in Warrington. I've not long finished work and I thought, why not come to town and do a little bit of blurry hunting for you guys? This is episode 10 in the series. I cannot believe it. I hope you're all having a great time with it because I know I am. But today, like I said, I'm going to go to HMV. I know the big sale event is still on and the stores do differ from the website from time to time in terms of the stock so i'm going to go check out hmv see what they've got and hopefully pick up a few things maybe some blu-rays and fingers crossed some good 4k titles as well i'm also going to go to the cinema today to see top gun and maverick i am on my own lucy's going out with her cousins tonight so i thought why not come out watch a movie it's national hot dog day so i'm going to get a free hot dog as well um, maybe some uh, popcorn we'll just see how it goes but anyway guys thank you so much for tuning into today's video i'm going to get straight into the shops now um without melting to death because i'm struggling and hopefully pick up some good titles but please stay until the end of the video to see what i picked up so first thing here is the unbearable weight of massive talent starring nick cage this is a new release we also have the standard release of drive here on 4k i already have the special collector set really really good set this is called red sonja i believe never heard of it but it stars arnold schwarzenegger possibly in the release but i'm not 100 percent sure and then we do have the northman here on 4k the first edition exclusive to hmv i do also have this already a fantastic release and i'm so happy to have it next up we do have here ambulance this is the new 4k i don't own this yet but this was a really good film um, from michael bay so definitely would recommend it if you haven't seen this one already taking a look at this movie right here this is doctor strange and it does come with a slip cover really good artwork uh, 24.99 for this one this is also a fairly new release moving on here to the big sale some 4ks here some are really good and some not so good but i will do a close-up so we have inglorious bastards this is the cine edition we've got rampage there reminiscent robin hood atomic blonde creed 2 skyscraper the rampage tomb raider split american made some really good titles now taking a look at the batman on 4k 24.99 a fairly new release still and again a lovely slip cover on this one really really nice and then taking a look at this film called the card counter starring oscar isaac do believe this released last year but only just come out here in the uk on blu-ray but a really really nice looking title i believe the film's really good and this is priced at 14 pounds 99 now looking at the worst person in the world this is a movie release or mubai however you say it 14.99 and again a very new release also looking at here the uh, under the silver lake £10.99 with a slip a really good offer and i believe movie bug picked this up um a while back so yeah and then we also have here drive my car again from Mubi mubai new release 14.99 and this is apparently a very very good film so i may have to pick this up and then we do have some more titles in the big sale west side story there i tonya the goonies queen and slim lord of the rings down there the dark knight yeah some really good titles and then we do have the offer on the premium collection two for 15 pounds you can see ghost there I'll do some close-ups as well in a second, but really good collection here, all two for £15. We have The Haunt in there, The Dirty Dozen, Clockwork Orange by Stanley Kubrick, The Golden Child, Forbidden Planet as well, Clash of the Titans, Trade in Places, The Phantom. And then the last two we've seen here is 2010, The Year We Make Contact, and then also King Kong, two very popular releases. So heading into CEX now to take a look at some Blu-rays. We have Ash versus Evil Dead season one for £18 here. I believe this show is very, very good. So I may have to watch this, but it is on Netflix. So I won't be picking this up. But we do also have here, I believe, season three. This one is £15. Um, very, very strange artwork on the back of this one. Not much text at all. And then we do also have season two, which I will show you guys now. This is £10 for this one. And I do prefer the artwork on the front and back. Very, very nice. But yeah, Ash Evil Dead, apparently it is really, really good. 
And then looking at some more Blu-rays, we have Billy Madison starring Adam Sandler, £6. And this is a, an old title, but a very, very good film. And this is one that I do not own in my collection. We also have here The Evil Dead. Shout out to Paul Tams. He sent me this when I won his competition a while back. But this is a very, very good film. And I really, really enjoyed it. I've yet to watch the original, but I definitely will ASAP. And then taking a look here at some of the 4Ks, nothing new here, a lot of these titles have been sitting here for weeks, The Marsh in there, Ad Astra, Leon, Jaws, Mulan, Infinite, nothing great, like I said, a lot of older titles. Okay guys, so back in the movie room, it is two days after my Blu-ray hunt in Warrington and I did see Top Gun Maverick as I mentioned early on in the video. It was fantastic, this was my second viewing of the movie and I thought it was faultless, I absolutely loved it. Goosebumps in so many scenes, emotional times, it was just great and I cannot wait to own it on 4K in the collection. It's going to be a day one pickup for me, it's my film of the year so far, I think it truly is fantastic i did get a couple pickups from the blu-ray hunt so i'm gonna get straight into those now and show you what i got so the first thing that i picked up is a movie from poundland this was a blu-ray for one pound um i've never heard of it before i do believe it is based off a shakespeare um it is called much ado about nothing um here it is right here it is directed by joss Whedon and it also stars Clark Gregg from the MCU so yeah I've seen uh, the Joss Whedon on the I've seen the Clark Gregg and I thought for a pound I'll pick it up and just see what it's about um, but yeah that was from Poundland and it was a pound. Sadly no pickups from CEX on this occasion there wasn't a big selection and a lot of titles have been sitting there for weeks on end so I didn't get anything on this trip however in hmv the sale was great i got some good footage today and i did pick up quite the haul so without further ado let's show you what i got from hmv the first thing that i want to show you guys is a blu-ray this was 2.99 with any purchase however this was actually one pound 99 when i got it installed this is an exclusive to hmv and it is a little uh, movie called elvis presley the searcher now this is exclusive to hmv Really nice slipcover. It comes with a soundtrack and a photo book as well. So I thought for £1.99, I thought the Elvis movie was fantastic. Um, and this was a pickup that I thought for £2, definitely worth picking up. But again, really interesting uh, movie here. Got a feeling it's going to be a documentary. But I just, yeah, I really like the slipcover. And it's got some good content to it. So I thought for £1.99, a definite pickup. The next thing that I picked up from HMV was Belfast. This is the new movie which I've heard nothing but good things about. I really, really wanted to check this out in the cinema, but unfortunately during the run, I was so, so busy and didn't have time to go check it out. So I have picked it up. I passed on the Prime Day offer. I think it was $7.99. It just, I, I, I don't know. I didn't pick it up. And then as soon as I seen it in HMV for $9.99, I thought, you know what? I'm just going to get it. So I'm sure it will be really, really good. So this is Belfast. It does come with a slip cover, as you can see. I'm never too fussed with slips on my Blu-rays, but when you can get them, it is always nice. But again, um, I can't wait to check this film out. I've heard it is brilliant. So I do have two more Blu-rays to show you guys, and then I will get onto the 4K pile that I've got sitting beside me. Now, these two Blu-rays are a little bit different. These are from a label I've never bought from before. However, I'm really excited to check these out. Now, the first one that I want to show you guys is a movie that I picked up because of James from Moviebug. He recommended this over one of his videos, and it stars a very, very popular actor and one of my favourites. This movie is called Under the Silver Lake, and it stars Andrew Garfield. This was £10.99 with a slip, and I do believe that the slips of these can be quite hard to find from time to time, and it is in really, really good condition there from HMV. And I'm a big fan of Andrew Garfield, so I had to pick this one up. Really, really interested in this one. Um, love the artwork on this, and the slips all match as well. So they will look really good on the shelf. And what I really, really like about this label is they haven't numbered the spines. So if you want to buy one, you can buy one. If you want to get three, four, five, you can. You don't have to feel obligated to buy the whole set. So this is a really, really nice pickup. And that is under the Silver Lake. And then to go aside that from movie, I did pick up a new release. This is very unlike me. I very rarely nowadays pick up a new release. 
but this again another big movie from earlier this year it is called drive my car this released on monday and i got this on wednesday so very very new pickup indeed it was 14.99 if you can see that on the back again really really nice slip cover it's gonna look really nice on the shelf and i'm just so glad that they're not numbered because i don't feel like i have to buy them all um, and if I do like these two, I'll, uh, I'll probably go and pick up another one. But yeah, this is Drive My Car. Very, very popular film from this year. It did very well with uh, picking up some awards. And this is a movie I've never seen, and I can't wait to check it out. Okay, so moving on to the 4Ks, the first thing that I'm going to show you is a very cheap pickup. This goes for around £4 in CEX, goes for very cheap on eBay as well. But this was £5 in HMV, brand new. Thought, you know what? I'm going to get it. I've been putting it off for years because it does not come with a slip cover. And I thought, you know what? I'll just get the Blu-ray. But I caved finally. I love the franchise. The film was not great, but I picked it up anyway. And it is Assassin's Creed. So it was $9.99 there on the sticker, but this was 50% off in store. So this was £5. So yeah, not the best movie, not by any means, but I am a big fan of the gaming franchise. So I thought, why not add this to my collection? So the next two things that I picked up from H&V were both 4Ks from Disney. These were both as well £11.99 each. So two for 24, really good deal. First up we have Beauty and the Beast and then another live action movie in Dumbo. Two movies I've never seen and two movies I really wanted in the collection and I got them for a good price so I can't complain. I do have another two 4Ks here that I also picked up for £11.99. So first up we have Jojo Rabbit, again with a very nice slip cover. Really like the artwork on the front. Um, I've never seen this film all the way through, so I do need to give it a proper watch. I remember putting it on really late at night one time and I was just nodding off. But for £11.99, really good deal and a movie that I've heard great things about. So I definitely need to get around to watching that as soon as I can. And then I picked up this movie right here. This is Unbreakable. And I do also have Split. So I just need to get Glass. And that will complete the trilogy. So very, very happy with this pickup. Uh, 11 99 again. Really good deal. And another movie I've never seen. So I can't wait to give this on a watch. Because I've seen Split. I've seen Glass. But never, ever seen Unbreakable. So I can't wait to get around to watching this. That brings me to the final thing that I picked up from HMV. And that was Inglorious Bastards. This is the Cine Edition exclusive to HMV. And this was £22.99. A really good deal. I have been debating picking this up since it released in HMV. And I finally pulled the trigger. Because this is a very, very good price. And again, this is another movie I've never seen. Uh, a Tarantino movie. I really, really am looking forward to watching this one. Great cast. Great movie, good story, and I can't wait to give this one a watch. A very, very nice addition to the collection. A little bit more limited, and you do get some art cards and stuff. I will, uh, you can pause the video there. Those are the contents, and uh, yeah, um, a really, really nice release. So that is Inglorious Bastards. Whilst in HMV, I did also return two items. So as a part of that haul, I did take two back. Um, I took back Baywatch on 4K along with The Many Saints of Newark. The slips are both damaged on them. Um, I changed my mind on them as well and I thought, you know what, I I'd rather get something that I'm definitely going to know that I'm going to watch. Um, so I thought this haul was definitely worth it, but I did want to mention that I took back two titles. And I think those were on a 2 for 25, so I didn't spend too much, which is not too bad either. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Blu-ray Hunting. If you did, please leave a like on today's video. Don't forget as well, go follow me over on Instagram at The Movie Insider. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you have hit that subscribe button. It really does mean a lot. But for now, guys, that has been me. And I will see you guys on the next one.